Hello and welcome to our channel Miners Point. So today our topic of discussion is tapet clearance. So if you like this video and you want to know more about other topics as well, you can subscribe to our channel. So let's start with the tapet clearance definition. So tapet clearance is a space between the top of the stem of the valve and the rocker arm when the valves are in closed position and engine is at cooled condition at the compression stroke. So let us understand it step by step. So first is the space between the top of the stem valve and the rocker arm. So here in this figure you can see, okay. In this figure you can see that here is the stem valve and this is the rocker arm, and there is a space between this. So this is known as the tapet clearance. But there are certain restrictions, that is conditions associated with this tapet clearance. The conditions are that the valve should be in closed position and the engine is at cold condition. So why valve should be in closed position? Because when the valve is in open position, so this spindle will be in the downward direction. So the spindle will be a little bit down. So the actual tap and clearance cannot be measured. That is why it should be in closed position. And next is the engine is at the cooled condition. So this condition is associated because when the engine is at working temperature or at high temperature, so there will be expansion in the working parts. And that is the valve stem will expand. So in that case, this uh, this gap may decrease. So you will not get the actual value of the tapet clearance. So whenever we measure the tapet clearance, we measure it at a cooled uh, when the engine is at cooled condition and the valve is in closed position. And it is also known as valve lash. So the other name of tapet clearance is valve lash. Next is the purpose of having a tapet clearance. So why tapet clearance is required? So it is required for the two things. First is to allow the thermal expansion of the valve spindle when uh, when the engine is in working condition, and it is used to ensure positive closing of the valve at all the working conditions and the temperature. So both of these things, if you observe clearly, it is the it both of them are interrelated. So first is allowing the thermal expansion. So when the engine is at working condition, so def definitely at high temperature the parts of the uh, engine will e expand, and because of that, as you can see here in the gap, so this gap will decrease as there will be thermal expansion in this stem. So because of which it can get hit into the rocker arm. So to avoid this, we uh, uh, this clearance is provided, and to ensure positive closing of the valve. So imagine a situation if at the higher temperature, if the spindle is touches the rocker arm, so in that case, it this this valve set will not get closed properly, and because of which, and the engine performance will suffer. So therefore, it ensures positive closing of the valve at all the working conditions. Next is to what are the effect. When the tapet clearance is not in proper condition, not in proper condition in the sense it can either decrease or increase. So if the clearance decreases, then the valve will open early and close late, and if the clearance increases, valve will open late and close early. Now to understand this, look at let us look at this picture. So here you can see this is the roller, and this is the tie rod. So when the when the cam rotates and it is at the peak, so it will push the roller and in turn the push rod will push the push the rocker arm. So when it will push uh, the push rod will push the rocker arm, so it will go upward and it will go downward. So if this tapet clearance is more, so this if this gap is more, so this rocker arm will take time to reach to this and to hit this valve stem. And as a result, the valve will open late. On um, on the contrary, if if the gap is less, so it will uh, the rocker arm will hit the valve stem early, and at because of which the valve will open early and close late. Now let us look at what will happen if the tapet clearance is less and the tapet clearance is more. So as we have discussed, it will when the tapet clearance is less, it will open early and close lately. And if the tapet clearance is more, it will open lately and close early. Next is what are the other things that are associated with the uh, tapet clearance? 
So next is a, when the tapet clearance is less, so the air induced in the combustion chamber, the so combustion through an inlet valve may leak out. So less air will be available for the combustion. As the valve is uh, opening early, so the air may leak out and hence less air will be available for the combustion. And as the less air of the, will be available for combustion, the engine performance will suffer. And also since uh, for the same, uh, since uh, the engine performance will suffer because the fuel consumption by engine will increase because for the same output you will have to burn more fuel. And what are the other worst conditions that can be associated when the tappet clearance is less is that it will have a loss of compression pressure, then burning of exhaust valve and increase in the turbocharger fouling. And if the tappet clearance is more, then it will reduce the maximum lift of the valve. As we have seen in the earlier that uh, uh, when the tappet clearance is more, so valve will open late and close early and th that will affect the maximum lift of the valve. And next is it will generate less heat energy to the turbocharger of the engine which will cause reduction in the scavenge air and hence the power of the engine will decrease. And there is no proper removal of the exhaust gas. As the valve will open late so the all of the exhaust gas will not be released at the proper time. And next is hammering of the valve stem cause damage to the valve stem. So it can cause damage to the valve stem also. And uh, in turn it will create noise and eventually damage the working surface of the valve. So this was the brief description about the tappet clearance. So far we have discussed that what is tappet clearance. We have seen the graphical picture of it and what will happen if the tappet clearance is more and what will happen if the tappet clearance is less. So to read more about in details, you can visit our website www.marinaspoint.in and you can see and search in the search bar tappet clearance. You will come with the post and you can read in detail. There we have mentioned how can you measure the tappet clearance as well. The link will be provided in the description. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel.